Well, hi there, and welcome to Chess Base Workshop. I'm Steve Lopez, your host. Thank you for joining us for this presentation, clicking on that link and opting in to see what we're going to talk about today. Chess Base has downloadable products now, where you can purchase them directly from ChessBase.com. And what we're going to look at today is how to go about doing that, how to purchase and download a product. Mainly we're looking at how to get to your login page and how to get to your downloads once you've purchased them. So, of course, this is the ChessBase website. You're familiar with it, exactly the way it appears in my browser. Uh, to get to the shop, that's the first step is to do your shopping. You just come way over here to the big red button that says Shop. Click on it and it brings you here. Uh, you can look at different categories of items. There's a whole bunch of categories over here. You can go right to an item. Uh, of course, the dollar amounts are given in euros, but if you want to make a purchase when you go to a particular page, just click and it will go into your shopping cart. However, in order to make the magic work, you need to have an account with chessbase.com. So we're going to show you how to set up an account. That's the first thing. If you come up here to the top of the screen, you will see a link that says My Account. Just click on My Account. It will bring you to this page. If you already have an account, if you've already set one up, it's real easy to get in. Just type in the email address that you provided and the password that you provided at the time that you set up the account and click Log In. However, if you have not set up an account yet, you'll need to click on this little link right here that says New Account. It's real easy. When you click on it, it brings you here. All you need to do is provide an email address and provide a password. Just type in a valid email address, password, and then retype the password to confirm it and click Register. And that'll get you in. That'll get you a new account. Either way, it will finally get you, either way you go this way, if you log in with an existing account, or you are creating a new account, you will ultimately wind up here where you have my account. That's normally what you'll see. If you log in, by the way, with email and password and select keep me logged in, it'll remember this on your computer so that when you click my account up here at the top, it will bring you here. But once you're into your account, it will show your email address that you provided, which I blanked out because it's my personal email address and you don't need to know that. You have a set of links your physical address. Now if you're going to order products that are going to be sent to you, you'll need to provide a physical address, a physical mailing address. That's not really what we need to look at here. We're talking about downloadable products. So you have, of course, you have to set up a payment method, either credit card or bank account. But ultimately, after you've purchased some downloadable products, you're going to want to be able to, to get to them. So what you have here is my downloads. There are two links one in the sidebar over here in this pane or over here it says my downloads when you click on it it will take you to a list of everything that you've downloaded your downloads will be listed in reverse order of purchase in other words your newest purchase will be at the top you'll see that I've just purchased the Courtenoy Gambit against the French previously though I've had a power play I bought and the chess base tutorials openings which I'm real fond of I like these videos a lot and of course my Fritz 13 is down here but my latest download is the Korsnoy Gambit against the French and I want to download it all I need to do is click on this link it says set up Collins the Korsnoy Gambit against the French that's actually a link if you click on it you get this should be familiar to you. All you have to do is click Save File, click that button, and pick a location on your hard drive to save it to. That's all there is to it. Just download it to your hard drive, save it there, and then run it later to set up your product that you have purchased. After you're done downloading your product, if you want to log out, very simple. You just go to My Account back up here at the top of the screen. It will bring you back here, and you'll see a button that says Log Out. Just click on that and that will log you out of your account. That's all there is to it. It's real simple. You just need to go to my account, set up an account if you've not already done so. If you have already done so, just type in your email address and your password and you can get to a page like this that shows you all of your products once you click my downloads. It will take you right here. Uh, please note that if you download a product to your hard drive and you crash your hard drive, you lose that file, whatever happens, you can always come back to my downloads and re-download a product that you have already purchased. So just keep that in mind. If you buy a downloadable product, you will be able to come back to chessbase.com and download it again if you need to, if you lose that original downloaded file. 
That's all there is to it. Downloadable products from chessbase.com. That's where you go. Just remember when you're on the first big page, the first page you get to at chessbase.com, click the big red shop button and then just follow all the steps. Till next time for Chess Base Workshop, I'm Steve Lopez reminding you to please do have fun.